Joe Bryant from Britain loves football, especially Germany's Bundesliga. Since he was nine, the boy from Crawley in West Sussex has been on a mission to build replicas of all 18 German Bundesliga stadiums using Lego toy bricks. I started building stands when I was like younger um, and then I went on holiday and I like, watched a lot of German football but at that time I was already deciding that I wanted to build like proper full-on like full Lego football stadiums and because I watched a lot of the German league and really liked it I decided to build German football stadiums. Slowly they're running out of room at the Bryant's home because in recent months, Joe Bryant has finished five more Bundesliga arenas, like the Borussia Dortmund Stadium. This one was definitely my most challenging stadium that I've had to build yet. Um, purely just because there's so many different features to it, like there's lettering uh, under the roofs, and then the, the roofs themselves are very difficult because they've got lots of like solar panels and patterns on them. It just looks really cool and most realistic stadium I've done, I've done in my opinion. You voted for it, so I built it. This is Borussia Dortmund in Lego. The 13-year-old posts pictures of his finished works on his social media channels. Photos of the real-life arenas serve as his guide, and he replicates them as best he can, with great attention to detail. His father, Phil Bryant, is his main advisor. He was eight years, nine years old, and his stadiums, we didn't have the bricks at that point to really do things, you know, he, he didn't have the, 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 the things that he could do now. So the stadiums were a little bit more basic, but I'm, funny enough, some of those stadiums are actually far more popular on YouTube than some of the uh, stadiums he builds now. Whether he's building models or kicking the ball around, Joe Bryant is always trying to up his game. And the number of invites he's received from Bundesliga clubs shows how good his miniature stadiums are. In 2019, he was allowed to present his replica of the Weser Stadium in Bremen during halftime at a league match. It's just a general experience where you've got the fans all, over the ra all around you um, and like it just feels quite, well, unreal because like, well, it just shouldn't really be happening. <laughs> Joe Bryant is currently working on the stadium that's home to Union Berlin. He needs up to 6,000 plastic bricks for each large-scale replica. Often, the club's fans help out. On the Union Berlin stadium, the fans uh, decided that it'd be cool to help me with certain bricks on the scoreboard. Um, and they sent me quite a lot of um, like specialist pieces that they've like, 3D printed. Each stadium he builds is a little more complex than the one before, but they all have their special challenges. They all have different features that make them difficult. For instance, Union Berlin's got like trees and slopes, which I've never actually attempted before. Uh, Wolfsburg's got like a roof that raises up and Dortmund, well, like the whole inside is just a challenge because there's so many things going on uh, and so many different like color patterns to it. The only German stadium that's hosting UEFA European Championship matches this time, Munich's Arena, is still on Joe Bryant's to-do list. However, after more than two months of construction, Union Berlin Stadium is finished. And it's a winner.